Welcome to Tricky's Kitchen where delicious food is made easy. Today Tricky is preparing chili chicken. Chili chicken is the most popular Indo-Chinese style appetizer. It is made with bite-sized chicken pieces that are slightly battered and deep fried and then tossed in a sweet, spicy, slightly sour chili sauce and it is packed with amazing flavors from both the cooking styles. So let's get straight to the ingredients. The ingredients for the marination. The ingredients for the sauce. And the other ingredients. Method, marinating the chicken. So wash, the, wash and chop the chicken into small bite sized pieces. Then add the chicken and the marination ingredients to a large mixing bowl. That's the Kashmiri chili powder, ginger garlic paste, pepper powder, salt, vinegar, oil, and the soya sauce. Mix well. Then cover with cling film and set aside to marinate for one hour or overnight if possible. Remember, the longer the better. We're now moving to prepare the sauce. So add all the ingredients for the sauce into a small mixing bowl. That's the water, soya sauce, vinegar, chicken bouillon powder, pepper powder, chili powder, salt, sugar, corn flour, tomato ketchup, and red chili sauce. Mix well. This is a good time to taste. So feel free to increase the quantity of any of these ingredients to adjust the taste you're liking. Then set aside for later use. When the marination is done, remove from the fridge, then add in the white of the egg, corn flour and the plain flour. Mix well to combine. We're moving on to the frying stage, so heat oil in the deep frying pan. Then gently drop in the chicken pieces and deep fry on medium heat until done. And remove and drain on the kitchen towel. Similarly, repeat the process of frying the rest of the chicken pieces in batches. And as before, remove and drain on the kitchen towel. The next stage, so heat oil in a wok. Drop in the garlic and toss. The alternate option is to drop in one small chopped onion after dropping in the chopped garlic. Then drop in the green chilies onions and capsicum and toss. Do not overcook the capsicum as it must remain crunchy. So cover and cook for a couple of minutes. Then drop in the sauce and give it a good mix. Then drop in the fried chicken pieces and mix well to combine. Finally, garnish with sesame seeds and chopped spring onions. And serve hot as an appetizer or with fried rice, noodles or with any other accompaniment of your choice. And there you have it, mouth-watering, sweet, spicy, slightly sour chili chicken. So thank you for stopping by. Do hope you will give this recipe a try. Have lots of fun in the process as you toy. And most of all, don't forget to enjoy. Tricky's Kitchen has lots of other chicken recipes that you would like to try. So be sure to click on the video link on your screen right now and watch another video.